Uh, look, I understand why she's upset. About, like, I'm not happy about the way politics have gone. It's not exactly been the way the, the way I would have hoped. I would have planned it, and and yeah. and that democracy doesn't always provide the outcomes you like. That's how democracy works. I think what I'd say in response to it is, look, all of us like and love parts of our country and all of us don't like other things. Yeah. I'm very proud of the National Health Service. I'm proud of uh, our diversity. I'm proud of people throughout our history who fought for our rights and freedoms, the welfare state, uh, workers' rights, women's rights. That's what I'm proud of. I don't like the racism that exists with some. Uh, I don't like our Tory government. I don't like those things. Uh, you know, the Daily Mail doesn't like multiculturalism or the National Health Service so much or the BBC. But it does it's like, it does like, it does, it, does, it might like the, the country. church. Yeah. No, but the point yeah. I'm making is yeah. we all like and don't like certain things. Right. But I think Hillary Mantel, rather than just say, oh, everything's a bit bleak, mm. she should say, you know, she should talk about things she loves. I mean, she's right. part of this, the this literature. Is, this, this is, is a shame, literature this is a shame of Britain. This is an absolute disgrace. And what's more disgraceful is, you said it was in the podcast, it's also in an interview she gave to La Republique, OK, the Italian newspaper. You don't go and talk to foreign newspapers about your country. It's freedom of this speech. Woman, she can say what this, she wants. This, of course she can say what she wants. I just think it's just wrong of her to do it. I, th I, think it's it's I think it's wrong of her to do it, OK? She has made her fortune on the history and the glory and the greatness of this country. Do you agree? As well, an author. She's, because who's, she's who's very not, talented. Who, if, I, I agree she's yeah. very talented. But she says here, I'm so fed up with the country now, I'm thinking of moving to Ireland. Hillary, I'll pay the fare. I'll pay the ferry well, fare. Well, that's I'm sure Ireland. she'll appreciate that. Get over yeah. to Ireland, will you, and stay there. Because ferry, you, you won't fly her over. Slagging your own just country. Buy, you're going to buy I a seat on a ferry. I, I just yes. think, look, at yeah. the end of the day, people have the right to freedom of speech. Of course they, can, they do. They can say what she wants. She's got she's got Irish heritage. That's why she's talking about returning to Ireland. Yeah, we should be absolutely clear about it. But I just think, you know, don't throw the baby out of the bathwater. Britain has Lots of brilliant things we should be proud of. This Other country things we should made her fortune and she's thrown well, it back in our faces. She, she did it because of her, oh, her, right, yeah. her talent, Mike. She guys, to do it.